Welcome back everyone, Kremlin Archer here, time for some more Project Zomboid. So we are playing the six months later setup. We're on a hardcore six months later setup. Um, I was trying to put us over the river using that over the bridge map, but I forgot that it just drops you right on the edge of the bridge. It doesn't actually drop you on the other side of the bridge. So we might not be going there right away. Um, but yeah, this is six months later. We are... We're a carpenter, or a lumberjack rather, high thirst, prone to illness, hemophobic, weak stomach, hypochondriac, slow reader, axe man, axe woman I guess in this case, dexterous, outdoorsman, runner, fast learner, thick skinned, stout, and then very underweight, or just underweight, not very underweight. So that's the setup. Six months later, so the, I actually think the date is, I think the date is in the fall, but I don't, yeah, I'm judging from all the trees without leaves. So we're gonna have to deal with temperature more than we would have otherwise. We're gonna have to deal with bigger hordes, as you can see. I'm gonna try and go across the bridge. We'll see. We may end up dying right away. <laughs> if we are, we can just restart. Um, bigger hordes. Yep. Less food, less things, you know, everything is going to be decayed. Food and water is already... The water and electricity are already off. They start turn. They start turned off. So we got that to deal with. Be very helpful if one of you had a weapon on you. Take the key. Yeah, she's getting cold. Oh, there's a watch right away. Yeah, 12. Yeah, so it's it's December. So it's gonna get chilly. It's just slightly above freezing right now. So hopefully we can do this without getting killed. How about you, buddy? You wanna come here? But I really, I have really wanted to explore this map, so we have been having extremely bad luck uh, making it work. So I'm just trying, trying to make it work. Of course, without our oh, kitchen knife, thank you. I was gonna say without a weapon, this is gonna be extremely difficult. Not that the kitchen knife is likely to last for very long, but it's something. I saw a zombie over here. Oh, there's a bunch of you in there. Crap. Oh, and there's one coming up the backside now, too. Oh, I can't afford those. Can't afford bad stabs. Oh, looks like the door broke. I think thick skin may have saved us there. Oh, hey. Easy there, buddy. There we got a temporary reprieve. Someone want to give me another knife or a screwdriver? Oh, normal hiking bag, that's something. I don't think this character has Lucky. I mean, I just read them off a minute ago, but I'm pretty sure that Lucky was not one of the traits we took. Because I seem to remember hoping, trying to figure out if I had enough points to get Lucky, and I didn't, so. Alright, let's try and take this lady first. Just by herself. I really do want to cross the bridge, but we gotta do this nice and easy. Oh, 
that's just you. And we're buzzing already. This one behind me. Somewhere, I can hear him. Could hear Demonin. I suppose he could be on the level below me. Anybody else still in here? No. I'm not gonna go upstairs though, because <laughs> there's probably more zombies up there. Plank and welding rods, nothing. Right, we can push forward a little bit here. My knife is about halfway done already. How you looking? One of you. There's more in that room. Alright. Hello. Don't push me away, I need to step on that lady. Alright, never mind. Push. Okay, we're making progress. <laughs> this is probably not the best plan in the world to do this. Probably should have just gone somewhere else. That would have been the smart thing to do. All you can eat. One of them saw us. Oh, broken windows. It sounds like it's coming from behind me. It is. I don't know how they found their way up here, but. Zombies are much better at tracking when they're trying to get to you than they are at, like, any other time. I don't know if she's starting to get tired or what, but this is... Definitely seems like she's having more trouble. Knocking zombies down. There's my very lucky weapon is almost toast now. And I don't know what we're going to do then. Yep, there it goes. Technically I can repair it, but I don't have any materials for that. Alright, I hear noises that indicate to me that there's something upstairs. I suppose I could wield this. Not exactly a good weapon, but I suppose it's better than nothing. We can still push and stuff if we need to. Blue pen. Can't do it you can't do stabs with pens. Otherwise, I would take it. Alright, what you got? Anything? Empty mug. Rotten food. Counting on there just being the two in here. 
key. Box of nails, sure. Rotten cheese. I need something to eat. Oh, what did I just see there? It was just a zombie. I'm scared of the second levels of any of these buildings, so I'm not, not going up on them. Rotten. Just the three of you? It's a very slow weapon. But at least it kills. We're running low on water now, too. Come on out. All right, come on, give me something. Yeah, they're empty. Thought maybe there'd be like just a little bit of water in the pipes. Oh god, oh god, oh god. Oh, they fell outside. All right, we're toast. See, that's why I didn't go upstairs. That's why you don't go upstairs, kids. See, they they attacked me from above and then immediately fell out the side and hit me from the bottom. That's why, uh, that's why there were suddenly a million zombies at the bottom of the stairs. <laughs> Alright, let me just recreate this character and we'll do it somewhere else in the world. I'm not gonna try and push this, this, uh, cross the bridge thing. Alright, we're back. We are in Rosewood this time. Just keep me far away from the bridge because the bridge is death to me apparently. We're still doing a six months later playthrough. Um, so, you know, materials are going to be hard to come by. All of my stats are the same other than this is a dude instead of a lady. Aside from that, it's all the same. There's literally nothing in this house. <laughs> Alright, that was a good start. Alright, let's head out. I don't know Rosewood very well, so this is going to be interesting. So we'll try and go this way. See, I don't know if I don't know Rosewood to know well enough to know that if I went back into those trees there, if that would be a very good idea. Oh, I think that lady's on to me. I really need the zombies to start clumping up a little bit so that I have pathways to exit through. A lot of stuff in that guy. Watch. Take the vitamins, why not? Nothing, nothing else useful. All right, we're gonna try to go this way. Two more that are interested in us. Third one's probably gonna come along just because the others are moving this way. <laughs> Keep checking, make sure nobody's behind me. That one over there just just caught sight of us. Then didn't check this guy. Both of you fall over. And 
pop? No. There we go. No watch. It's nothing. Nothing helpful here. All right, I can't keep killing every zombie we deal with here, so we're just gonna have to run for it. I think. Let's run this way. We're just gonna run. Don't see anything down any of these roads, which makes me a little unnervous, but we gotta go somewhere. Oh, I think I know where we are. I think the uh, fire station is up ahead. Yep, fire station. Alright. New plan. We're gonna mass up zombies and move them out of this area. Come on, everybody. We're gonna go for a little walk. Make sure they're all coming with us. One's in the back, I'm gonna start drifting here in a second. All right, let's tighten the circle. Good zombies, everybody come this way. Excellent. Well done, zombies. Let's all come over here. Get this group again. Oop! Careful! 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 Sorry, I'm a little more zoomed out than I would like to be, but um, for this particular maneuver, it's kind of important to be able to see as far as I can. start sneaking here. We still got these guys on us. Alright, I'm gonna have to keep get more. Oh, I didn't want to get more, but we're gonna have to get more. Wish I had a means to start a fire. I'd start a fire down here. Burn some zombies up. I need some. I need a little bit larger stand of trees to get a, get space. That's the police station right there. Right, I'm gonna start sneaking now. This is likely to bring like a lot of zombies down on the police station, but so be it. There's another door. Hang on. We're just not a, as much as I would like to loot this place. We're gonna use it to our advantage here. And we are going to zip through it. So we find a hammer, which is an acceptable weapon. We're gonna go out this way. Okay. All right, that was a little bit exciting. Welcome to Rosewood, am I right? 
tired like pushing a little bit more difficult you want to get caught on some piece of furniture here I'm gonna break you guys up a little bit Please die. There we go. Nothing. Nothing. Some zombies beyond the trees that are probably gonna come this way. They get like a direction in mind. And they will path all the way along a fence to get to like right there when they were standing there and they wanted to get across. Yep, they're breaking through. All right, let's do a little bit more looting inside here. We'll we'll try and be safe about it. Hello. Pins, long shorts. Drink some water since we're probably getting close to needing to drink water. Oh, hello. On all this, need a bag, but this is surprisingly a lot of stuff for a playthrough like this. Right, we're gonna get a little bit more picky here. Tweezers, alcohol wipes. Are you out here? No, I must be outside the building. Duct tape, sure. Twine, golf club. I could climb the pole. You go upstairs. Some nails and some wire. All right, that's about it for here. All right, I'm gonna stop here for today, and I will pick it up next time. Thanks so much for joining me, and I'll see you guys later.